Shalom Yasharala, peace Israel, Ka Halayim La, Allah Hayyanawa, Abanawa, Yahawa, Bahasham, Yahawa Shai, Bahasham, Rakha Hakudash, all praise to our power, our Father, Yahawa, in the name Yahawa Shai, in the name of the Holy Spirit, double honor to our teachers, the elder apostles and elder bishops of Great Millstone, peace and blessing to you hopeful elect out there. Those of you that believe in this word in truth and in sincerity, the house of David, peace and blessing to you. What we're going to be speaking about today is proof that the sons of Noah existed. Proof that the sons of Noah existed. And their sons existed. Because everyone on the planet Earth descends from one of Noah's three sons. After the flood, after the worldwide flood, the Earth was repopulated by Noah's three sons and, and their sons. Okay. And what we're going to be speaking about today is Noah's son, Japheth, in particular, and his descendants. Now, you have a group of people that are known as the Javanese. The Javanese people. And this should remind you of a scripture. Okay. Now we're going to look into the Javanese people. But right before we do that, we're going to get this scripture. Or these scriptures. We're going to read Genesis. Chapter 10. And verse 1 down to 5. Genesis chapter 10 verse 1. Now these are the generations of. Of the sons of Noah, Shem, Ham, and Japheth, and unto them were sons born after the flood. And the sons of Japheth, Gomer, and Magog, and Madai, and Javan, and Tubal, and Meshach, and Tyrus. And the sons of Gomer, Ashkenaz, and Rephath, and Togomar, and the sons of Javan. Uh, Elisha and Tarshish, Kittim and Dodanum. By these were the isles of the Gentiles divided in their lands. Everyone after his tongue, meaning after his language, after their families in their nations. Now, the key point it mentions Javan. Javan is mentioned. As one of the sons of Japheth. Okay. So this is something that stood out to me. You have a group of people called the Javanese people. And you can look this up for yourself. Look it up for yourself. All right. The Javanese. Now I want to clarify something before we, you know, dig into a little of the uh, info on them. What you have to understand is that a lot of people on the earth have been scattered, and you have a lot of the other nations living amongst each other. You know, so. I'm going to read about the Javanese people. I believe these people are Japheth. And to me, them having the name, you know, you know, Javanese is a uh, spiritual indicator that they're Japheth, you know. And, and they live on, you know, uh, one of the islands that, that you can pretty much tie into the other islands that Japheth would live upon. So I believe this is the, uh, you know, the people of Japheth. Okay, 
but also a lot of the other heathens, they live among each other. So you can have Elam among them. You can have Moab and Ammon among them. Okay. But collectively, I do believe that this is a Japheth. All right. Which is more proof that, you know, Noah's descendants existed and do exist. All right. Which means that Noah's sons is existed, which means that Noah existed, which means that everything we read about in the scriptures actually took place. Okay. It all happened. And it's happening. All right. So let's read about the Javanese people. The, the Javanese. Okay. They have uh, Indonesian, or Orang Jawa, Javanese, Wong Jawa. And you have to remember they have their own languages, you know. Now it says, are an Austronesian ethnic group native to the central and eastern part of the Indonesian island of Java with more than 100 million people. Javanese people are the largest ethnic group in both Indonesia and in Southeast Asia as a whole. Their native language is Javanese. It is the largest of the Austronesian languages in number of native speakers and also the largest regional language in Southeast Asia. Okay. And um and they give you a picture right here. So here's a photograph. A Javanese uh you know a, a bride and groom. Javanese bride and groom wearing a traditional garb, which is their clothing. Now it mentions Austronesian. They're an Austronesian ethnic group. And keep in mind they're they're on the uh it says Central and eastern part of the Indonesian island of Java. Okay. But remember Austronesian. Let's look that up. Austronesian peoples. The Austronesian peoples, sometimes referred to as Austronesian speaking peoples, are a large group of peoples in Taiwan, Maritime Southeast Asia, parts of mainland Southeast Asia, Micronesia, coastal New Guinea, Island Malay, Melanesia, Polynesia, and Madagascar that speak Austronesian languages. You know, so, um, you know, it, it's a large group, you know, so you have a, a, a collection of nations that, that speak, you know, um, similar languages, okay? And they live amongst each other. But, you know, the Heavenly Father, he did separate the nations. He separated the peoples. And as I mentioned before, you, you do have a lot of the nations living amongst each other, but they're still separate, you know. With something I take in the spirit, I do believe that this is, uh, you know, Japheth, you know. But they may have Moab among them. They may have, you know, Elam among them. But I believe this is Japheth, you know. So just something that stood out to me was that name Java or Javanese. Because it, it reminds me of the... Uh, the name Javun, which is one of the sons of Japhet. Okay. And looking at the um the Javanese people, they remind me a little bit of the people in Hawaii, you know. Now they dress differently, but there's a, a certain way that they carry themselves, there's a certain air about them, you know. And you have that one place, bro. Uh, what is it called? Is it called Bali? I know a lot of um, a lot of Edomites 
love speaking about Bali. You know, because a lot of them used to, uh, you know, travel there. A lot of them still go there. But when you look into Bali, which, uh, if I'm not mistaken, is that near or in Indonesia? Okay, yeah, here we go. The Balinese people are an Austronesian ethnic group native to the Indonesian island of Bali. Right, and they mention Java again. You see that? They mentioned Java right there. Now, once again, to balance it out, I'm sure there's Elam among them. You may even have Moab and Ammon among them. But I believe this is Japhet, you know? They have crazy beliefs, you know? Their, their beliefs are far left because they're heathens, you know? Okay, and I'm not here to speak about the greatness of the heathen because they're still outside of Israel. You know, the other nations, they're our enemies. I'm only bringing this out because this is proof that, that the sons of Noah, you know, that they're here, you know, because everyone descends from the sons of Noah. Okay. So I find it interesting, you know. But the Lord, Yahweh, you know, the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, he made nations like within nations, you know. Because when, when you look at, you know, really all nations, there there's families within a family, you know. Because you look at Japheth here, you know, um, once again, pulling this up again. Okay, and we, and we can look at the Bali people, you know, again. They're similar, you know, they're the same family, but, but you know, they're different, you know? And the Lord did all nations like that. Even when you look at, you know, our people, when you look at Israelites, you know, we're Israelites, but, but we're all different. You know, we live in different areas. We, we talk differently. Some of us look differently, but the Lord did the other nations, you know, in a similar way. All right. But yeah, this got to be Japheth, bro, you know. But yeah, just something I found interesting. I don't want to make it too long because the point really is proven you know javanese should remind you of javan one of the sons of Japheth. okay and lord will when i find more info dealing with the other sons of noah such as shem such as ham i'll bring out info on that as well you know lord will if i come across anything but you know this is just something interesting i pray this is edifying i want to say call her la Allah Yahweh, Abinawa, Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakwadash, double honor to our elder apostles and elder bishops, great millstone. Peace and blessings to you, hopeful elect out there, the house of David. Shalom.